Mr. Speaker, you know, I was trying to follow Senator Gerald Gay, and I was getting high. You know, I was wondering whether he's, he smoked some uh, good marijuana in the morning or what, because he was not really making sense. He was completely incoherent. I didn't know what he was talking about. You know, he says, Senator Omogeni, he says, Jakaranda, he says everything. Seriously, can we just remain relevant? Mr. Speaker, I think this leeway you're giving us some time, it's messing everything up. So really, if I don't have a problem legalizing marijuana. I think it's a good thing, but appearing that you're smoking it, maybe we should give you a, a bottle of Glen Fiddich. might put your head proper. <laughs> Senator Gerarge, I want to agree with what members are saying. You be clear in what you want to say, and please conclude so that we make progress. No, Mr. Speaker, it's, it is dangerous that you are likely agreeing with them that I'm smoking marijuana. I don't know whether you are agreeing on that part because I don't smoke anything. Uh, Mr. Speaker, uh, the only smoke I smoke is when I was cooking in the village kitchen. So, Mr. Speaker, what I was just saying, I just said allegedly, and I think members should listen keenly and carefully. Finally, Mr. Speaker, because I don't want to drag and we have a heavy agenda ahead of us, is that I oppose this amendment. It is wrong timing. It is not made in good faith. Let us collapse this bill until the next session of Parliament, Mr. Speaker, then we can have an opportunity of going through it. And I want, I know, Majority Leader, God willing, will be around, so he can remain as an institutional memory and representative of West Pokot and ensure that this issue are put to conclusion in the next session of Parliament. I thank you, Mr. Speaker. <laughs> okay. <laughs> Senator Mogheni. <laughs> Yeah, th thank you, thank you, Mr. Speaker. Um, I, I sympathise with the position that uh, Majority Leader is this morning. Ordinarily, Mr. Speaker, uh, this is this is something that we should applaud and say this is a good bill and we support. The only problem, Mr. Speaker, is the timing. Uh, the timing at which this bill is coming uh, before us. Really, going through it, especially. Uh, the one dealing with the election campaign financing bill, uh, there's nothing uh, really big one can say about it. It's amending principally two uh, sections of the Act, 16 and 14. I mean, uh, Section 29 and uh, I believe Section 16 of the Act. But, Mr. Speaker, the problem is, uh, as I said, the problem is, is the timing, Mr. Speaker. 